Yeah, well, I was at one park and there was nowhere to fish because there were so many people packed up there. So I came to this other park where nobody ever fishes. So it's like, it's always been considered contaminated water. Nobody ever thought there was any fish in there. And since I started fishing here, it's blown up. Now there's nowhere for me to fish. Maybe there's a spot over here. But this is why I don't want to give anybody any information. Everybody wants to ask, ask me where I'm, where I'm at, what spots I go to. There's a reason I don't answer those comments. Got him that time. Ooh, that's a little bass. Did I bring my tape measure? Yeah, I did. Not that I'm keeping him, but still. I think he's a little bit too small anyway. I think I had a bite there. Got one. Little sunfish. Well, fat little sunfish. All the times I've been out here, never seen anybody else fishing. And today there's five other people. All right, let's go with a white this time, white time. It's got a lot more movement. Got it that time. Finally. It's not that big, but a nice one. I'll just get a picture of it real quick. I don't want to keep it out of the water too long. I'm not going to enter it into the, any tournaments or anything like that. All right. And there he goes. Ah, finally. Now I'm just going to move on. Oh, that was... That was easily the most frustrating fish I've ever dealt with. <laughs> I don't know how many times I've had a bite. Yeah, finally figured out its pattern, what it did and didn't like. <sighs> I think I've just got him out of annoyance, bothering him so much. <sighs> you know what, when you haven't been catching crap all day and you hit a snag, it feels like a fish. Finally. What is it? Sunfish. <laughs> Look at that hook set. I wasn't even recording, but I just had a fish, a little sunfish, but still. I was tangled up on something. I was trying to get it untangled and I hooked him. There's another one. Sunfish are going after it a lot now. <laughs> <laughs> 